for many biological and other problems by uh, polynomial algorithms are missing so we cannot use the algorithms to find the optimal solutions of many of these problems to overcome this problem computer scientists they have compromised the solutions and they have come up with the approximation algorithms so these approximation algorithms they provide the solutions up to a approximate level and they are not the perfect algorithms but still they can provide some approximation solutions of the problem so we will see how these uh, approximation algorithms will work so this is the approximation ratio of algorithm a on input as is defined as a pi over optimum pi so this is approximation algorithm and it do not give us the optimum output after receiving an input so in this equation a pi divided by optimum pi a pi is the solution produced by the algorithm a and this solution is the approximation solution and not the optimum solution and optimum pi is the correct optimal solution of the problem so we after dividing the a pi with the optimum pi we will come up with the approximation ratio and we will obtain the value of optimum pi by using different methods and we will come up with the optimum solution of the problem so the approximation ratio we have already calculated by dividing the a pi over optimum pi or we can say the performance guarantee of algorithm a is defined as its maximum approximation ratio over all input of sizes that is as maximum a pi over optimum pi and pi mod is equal to n so here we can see this mod means that we have some value that is equal to n and these two marks means mod and if we replace any of the value with pi for example it is 6 mod it means 6 but interestingly if we have minus 6 mod then again this minus 6 will be equal to 6 so this mod value means it is always a positive integer so here we can see this should be always the positive integer when we use this formula to calculate the maximum approximation ratio so on the other hand if a is the minimization algorithm that is an algorithm that attempts to minimize its objective functions then for this one again we can uh, say that this uh, maximization algorithm the approximation ratio should be minimum and the same formula will be applied here also a pi optimum pi and pi mod is equal to n and we have seen what is the meaning of pi mod is equal to n so pi mod will always be a positive integer even if its value is negative so in essence an approximation algorithm gives a worst case scenario of just how far off an algorithm output can be from some hypothetical perfect algorithm so it means we can calculate the approximation algorithm and we can also calculate that how much it will deviate from the perfect solution of a problem so the approximation ratio of this simple reverse sort algorithm is at least n minus 1 divided by 2 so a biologist has no guarantee that this algorithm 
comes anyway close to the correct solution. For example, if n is 1001, then this algorithm could return a series of reversals and that is as large as 500 times than the optimal solution. So our goal is that approximation algorithm will better perform performance and approximation ratio of 2 and we can even get a better ratio of 1.1 ratio. And we can see here that of course an algorithm with an approximation ratio of 1 will be the best possible solution that can be found with these approximation algorithms. But unfortunately these type of algorithms cannot be designed or cannot be produced up till now and there is no possibility that these type of algorithms can be produced in the future. So up till now the best algorithm for sorting by reversals and it has the best performance guarantee of 1.35. So more than 1.375 approximation ratio has not been achieved so far.